Well, this is the beautiful scenery from Onken Head. And we've come here today for the sod cutting of a brand new house. Why? Well, apparently it's going to be slightly unusual. Certainly it's going to be a grand design and it's going to be a bit like Crystal Palace, I understand, and very eco-friendly. So over the next year, we're going to follow its progress as this amazing structure takes place. We've been catching up with the owner to find out why he's done it. Uh, yes, it's, it's going to be Manx designed, Manx built, conceived in Ramsey and executed in Onken by McCards out of south of the islands, mm. aren't they, Port Erin? Um, yeah, it, it, we're, we're expecting it to be a statement of modern design when seen from the seaside, but not to upset the horses and the neighbours when seen from the roadside. It looks like a conventional bungalow from there. Uh, I've got some pictures of it on board. Here's, here's the lady that really designed it all. Ah. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> so we're, we're, this we're, is Maureen hello, Masters Maureen. or hi, Masters. Hi there. No. <laughs> so it's going to be like grand designs, I hear. This is the thing. It's going to be it's very striking. Uh, well, I believe so. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I believe so. You cooked it up with uh, yes, the man uh, up there. My architect and I did um, design a dream, and I think it's now going to happen. And it's going to take, what, a year to build? Yes. There's been some yes. debate about that, but 52 <laughs> weeks is what we're batting around, uh, a week or two either way, depending on the weather, I suppose. At the same time, it's going to be very eco-friendly, I understand. Well, three quarters of the way there, not in a mm. fanatical sense. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're not quite up to that sort of design features. No. But yes, I would say three quarters of the way there. And uh, here's going to be sort of like a bit of like Crystal Palace. <laughs> Somebody rather wickedly called it Crystal Palace by the Sea. I'm not saying who that was. <laughs> my, my Crystal Palace by the Sea, yes, that's oh. right. I think it was the man who was going to finance it called it that. <laughs> <laughs> so why did you decide to go for this sort of thing? Well, I think this site, having looked literally around the world, this site and this island is the best place I've found anywhere. Right, that's yes. interesting. Love it, absolutely love it. So we went off to the local surveyor man and said we want to extend it, we want to put another half on the side here. <laughs> and he then surveyed what stood here and said, I wouldn't do that, I'd knock it down and start again. Um, it took us a few weeks actually to get our head around that idea that yeah. that was the best way of doing it. But as you can see, that was the final decision and, and here we are with a clear sight. Well, we'll be following your progress over the year. This feels a bit like Grand Designs now, doesn't it, this <laughs> programme? And um, we, we look forward to the progress it makes and uh, all the very best today because you're going to do the first cutting the sod. Yes. yes. We look forward to that also. And we'll be pleased to see you again. Thank you.